Pie. Welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Okay, part three. You are all dating the same guy. Hey, I know that guy you're dating. Yeah, I do. He's that guy that's so tired from work, so stressed about the project he's working on. He's just been through an awful breakup and it's really hitting him hard. His parents' divorce has scarred him and he has trust issues. Right now, he has to focus on his career. He can't get involved with anyone until he knows what his life is about. He just got a new apartment and the move is a bitch. As soon as it all comes down, he'll leave his wife, girlfriend, crappy job. God, he's so complicated. He is a man made up of entirely of excuses, and the minute you stop making excuses for him, he will completely disappear from your life. Are there men who are too busy or have been through something so horrible that it makes it hard for them to get involved? Yes, but there are so few of them that they should be considered urban legends, for as already suggested, a man would rather be trampled by elephants that are on fire than tell you that he's just not that into you. That's why we've written this book. We wanted to get the excuses out of the closet, so to speak. So they can be seen for exactly what they are. Really bad excuses. Hey, do you remember that movie when the girl waited around for the guy to ask her out? Then made excuses when he didn't? Then she slept with him when they were both drunk and basically just hang around until they were kind of dating? Then he cheated on her? But because she knew deep down inside that if she forgave him and kept her expectations low and was really agreeable that she'd get him in the end? He was drunk at the wedding, but they lived miserably ever after in an unsatisfying relationship that was built on shitty foundations. You don't? That's because those movies don't get made. Because that's not what love is like. People are inspired to do remarkable things to find and be with the one they love. Big movies are made about it. Every relationship you admire bursts with greatness that you hope for in your own life. And the more you value yourself, the more chance you'll have of getting it. So read those excuses, have a laugh, then put them all down to rest. You're worth it. So that's it for today. Don't forget to check the links on my channel. Links down below. Like, subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded. Take care and blessed be.